Welcome to Math Gist. In this class, we want to find the value of a from this given nice equation. a raised to power 3 plus a square is equal to 36. Please like, share, comment, and subscribe. Thank you. We have solution. a raised to power 3 plus a square is equal to 36. Now, let's check to find the first root first. At a equal to 1, now 1 raised to power 3 plus 1 square is not equal to 36. One raised to the power three plus one square is not equal to thirty six. Let's check. At a is equal to two. Now, two raised to the power three plus two square is not also equal to thirty six. Now let's see. At a is equal to three. Now, t raised to the power 3 plus 3 square is equal to 36 because t raised to the power 3 is 27 plus 3 square 9. This is equal to 36. So, a equal to 3 is one of the roots. Now, a raised to the power 3 plus a square is equal to 36 can be replaced as t raised to power 3 plus 3 square. Now, a raised to power 3 plus a square minus 3 raised to power 3 minus 3 square is equal to 0. Now, let's compare. a raised to power 3 here, 3 raised to power 3 here, a square here, and 3 square here. a raised to power 3 minus 3 raised to power 3 plus a square minus 3 square is equal to 0. Let's remember this identity that if you have a raised to the power 3 minus b raised to the power 3 is equal to a minus b into a square plus b square plus ab. Also, a square minus b square, this is equal to a plus b multiplied by a minus b. In this case, our a is equal to a and our b is equal to 3. Now we have a minus 3 into a square plus 3 square plus three a plus a plus three multiplied by a minus three is equal to zero. Now a minus three is common here, a minus three is here. Let's factor it out. A minus three open bracket a square plus three square is nine plus 3a plus a plus 3 is equal to 0. Let's see. a minus 3, open bracket, a square plus 9 plus 3, this is 12, plus 3a plus a, 4a is equal to 0. Now we have two cases here. A minus 3 is equal to 0, therefore, A is equal to 3. In this case, we want to find the real value of A. Now, let's see what will happen. For the second case, we have A square plus 4A plus 12 is equal to 0. This is a quadratic equation. 
which can be solved using quadratic general formula. Our quadratic general formula is giving us S is equal to minus B plus or minus square root of B square minus 4AC divided by 2A. Then A is equal to 1, B is equal to 4, C is equal to 12. Let's substitute. Minus, we have A is equal to minus 4 plus or minus square root of 4 square minus 4 multiplied by 1 multiplied by 12 divided by 2 multiply by 1. Now, A is equal to minus 4 plus or minus square root of 4 square is 16 minus 4 times 1 times 12. This is 48 divided by 2 multiplied by 1. This is 2. Now, in this case, we're going to have a complex solution. Or our discriminant is equal to b squared minus 4ac. Let's see. This is equal to b is 4 squared minus 4 multiplied by 1 multiplied by 12. This is equal to 16 minus 48. This is equal to minus 32, which is less than 0. Now we reject this. The only true solution we have, or real solution we have, is a is equal to theory. That is our final answer. We can check to confirm if our answer is right or wrong. The given equation is a raised to power theory plus a square is equal to 36. At a is equal to theory, we have t raised to power theory plus theory square must be equal to 36. Theory to power theory. This is theory times theory times theory, which is equal to 27. Theory square is theory times theory. It's equal to theory square. This is 9. We have 27 plus 9. This is equal to 36. We satisfy the given equation at A equal to theory. If you love the class, please like, share, comment, and subscribe. Thank you so much.